Woo! Okay, here we go. All right, we're here again. It is uh, sunny. Excuse my eyes. I'll be squinting through some of these videos. I'm gonna sit down here real quick. It's June of 2021, okay? And still, catalytic converters are still getting stolen. This is a SULEV car. What does that mean? Super ultra low emissions vehicle, okay? Now, here's the thing that bothers me, okay? There is zero, no aftermarket catalytic converter that will work in this car because of it has to match the engine family number. The engine family number has to match when the database for whatever catalytic converter you put on, will be welded on, bolted on, whatever. There's none. There's none there right now. Now we've contacted companies and they, and, and, you know, they said, oh, maybe in a month we were supposed to have one at the beginning of this month and it didn't come out, whatever. I don't know the case, whatever. Now the other option is Honda, right? Well, it's the same thing. Honda, nothing, zero. Back order, you know, like, and who knows? They don't give you a time. It could be a month, two days, a year, who knows? So what does that mean? Well, that means the insurance company is probably gonna pay you off and your car is toast. They're gonna total your car. You have no options, that's it. And oh, here's the other thing too. We don't have, right now, there is no CAT security shield for this. Now we've contacted them and they say that they may be making it down the line or whatever, but there's nothing you can do. So what can you do? Uh, park your car in a lit up area, park your car in your driveway, try to park your car inside your property, whatever. It, it, it's the most you can do, you know? Um, and then if you do happen to hear someone go into your car, you see someone going around your car, call the cops. Don't try to go up to these people. Most of the time they come in, watch the videos out there on, on, on the other channels and everything. You'll see the thefts, right? You'll see that there's pretty much three people, okay? There's a lookout, a driver, and the guy who actually goes underneath there. Anyway, so don't approach these guys. You never know what they have, okay? And that, that's the main thing I wanted to say. Do not approach these people because you just don't know. It's not worth it. I know it's very, very expensive. I know, okay? And then, and then you're left with no car. I get it. But is $5,000 worth your life? No, I don't think so, okay? I'm just leave it at that. Maybe you're thinking to yourself, well, why can't you get another catalytic converter and just put it in there? Physically, uh, you can put another catalytic converter in there, another family engine number and put it in there, it'll fit, okay? Or get one welded in. But it's the, the numbers don't match, right? So if the numbers don't match in California, you try to go to pass smog, that's it. You cannot pass smog. So then you're left at square one with a, a car that's just toast. 